Colorado Attorney General Cynthia Kaufman has joined two dozen other states in a case challenging the Obama administration's clean air proposal. In turn, Governor John Hickenlooper has asked the Colorado Supreme Court for a ruling on whether she is standing to do so. His argument basically starts with this question, who is the AG's client? The EPA is demanding a 28% reduction in CO2 emissions by 2030. The AG is right to fight it. The plan could impact jobs and the price of electricity. It's also unlikely that Congress ever intended to give the EPA authority for such regulation when it passed the Clean Air Act. And it's unlikely that Coloradans expected their AG to exceed her authority. I'm no lawyer, but former AG Ken Salazar is, and his take is that the Attorney General must be the lawyer for the governor and the executive branch agencies, and as such, the Attorney General and her office provide legal guidance and support under the strict requirements of the Code of Professional Responsibility. The Attorney General represents the state, not the governor, and she is right to fight federal overreach. Disagreements happened in the past when Norton and Romer held these positions. Hickenlooper should join Kaufman and not let his loyalty to the president determine his reaction to the EPA's power grab.